what's up guys it's your girl sierra and i'm back with another video and you guys today is tuesday january what is the date january 16th okay and i am off and i'm just laying in my bed and i just wanted to show you guys like just a realistic day um in my life when i am off of work um also you guys today i woke up to some exciting news um i am officially monetized and <clears throat> a part of the youtube partner um program so i'm so happy i'm so thankful i'm so grateful and i just wanted to tell you guys thank you so much um i'm about to get up and brush my teeth, wash my face, get my clothes on, and do something with my life. I need to wash clothes. I need to do something. <clears throat> but the whole goal for me today was to get some rest. Um, Because I had that swollen lymph node, And it's still pretty swollen. So, <clears throat> I'm just resting. Honestly, getting some rest. I needed some rest. Um, And yeah, so I'm going to get up. Make my bed, brush my teeth, wash my face, find something to cook for dinner. I have to wash clothes. I just got a couple of things I need to do around the house. Um, and I just wanted to bring you guys along with me. <clears throat> so, yeah, a realistic day in the life of moi when I am off work. Okay? Again, thank you guys um, for 4,000 watch hours. I think I actually have five. I'm not sure. I can't see them now. Um, all of my videos have money signs, which means I am able to make money on YouTube now. I'm so happy, y'all. All I could do was pray and just thank God for the many blessings. Because I told y'all this year was going to be the year that I made the most money that I ever made in my life. And that I saved the most money that I ever saved in my life. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. And I hope you guys stay around to see to see this journey and um, to just grow with me, okay? I love you guys. Let's get up and get our life together, okay? I'll be back. I never said I was going to get you no candy. I can see, but Daddy or Kayla probably ain't on that thing down there. All right, you guys, so my neck is swollen, as you can see, and it's really bothering me. And I forgot that I have my ibuprofen at the pharmacy that I need to go pick up. So, look at this. Look don't at play this no girl. music. She fell. Oh. No, she fell. And this is just like killing me, y'all. It's so comfortable. It's so just like big I can feel it when I talk when I chew when I eat and it had it it has not swelled up all day until I went to eat um a piece of Reese chocolate take five um bar it's that time of the month for your girl you know and I wanted a piece of chocolate before I brush my teeth <laughs> so I ate a piece and as I was cooling, it started to swell up. And then, it's so uncomfortable. I feel like that urgent care did not do as much as they could have. They definitely could have gave me some antibiotics or something. Instead of just the ibuprofen. And then I forgot that Walgreens called me this morning and told me that the ibuprofen was ready for pickup. 
and I need to go down that way anyway because I got to work tomorrow and I need some air in my tire. And that's the only place I know where to get free air from because I don't know how to pump it. Free air that you don't have to pump at that. So, you know. Um, yeah, so I'm like, let me get up, <clears throat> brush my teeth, wash my face. It is like 3.30 in the afternoon and I have not done that all day. I just been laying in bed resting, literally resting, y'all. Because the doctor said that the virus was coming on and I absolutely feel, I started to feel like crap this morning. So I was so excited about my monetization on YouTube. I got on my computer and I did a little bit of stuff uh, that I needed to do. And then I was sitting in my chair and I was just getting sleepy and sleepier and sleepier. And then um, I laid back down. I got back in the bed. So that's all I've been doing all day. I still have on my, my PJs. I just been laying in the bed. I'm just, I'm tired. My body just probably need rest. From all those days, I just did, you know, working and just, I need to rest. <clears throat> but unfortunately, I have to go outside in this cold and go get my ibuprofen because this thing is inflamed and it's really just bothering me and I'm hungry and I just need to get up and get moving because I'm starting to feel like crap and I don't want to make myself feel like I'm getting sick when I'm not even sick. You know what I'm saying? Once somebody tell you something, they could tell you, oh, you can be perfectly fine today. Then you go to the doctor tomorrow and they tell you got cancer. Now all of a sudden you land in the bed and you feel sick and you feel like crap and you just want to die. You know? So I don't want to start feeling like that because I have to go to work. And this is my weekend to work. Today is Tuesday. I have to work Wednesday, Thursday, off Friday, then I have to work Saturday, Sunday, and then I'm off Monday and Tuesday. But, you know, I have stuff to do. Like, I don't want to be in the bed sick. I don't want to be feeling like crap. I don't want to... I just don't want to get sick, y'all. I hate getting sick. So then, the school is called. Just sent the email. Okay, now, school is saying that they're not going to have school tomorrow. Because it's going to be dangerous, dangerous temperature weather so um no school for kids tomorrow y'all my lips is dry i need my glasses on kayvon kayvon just got home from school kayvon come here like my seatbelt school cancels tomorrow i know did you have a good day at school mm -hmm. what you was doing Mondo has school. Mondo has school tomorrow. Well, they didn't say nothing yet about your school, but you don't have to go if you don't want to, because it's gonna be cold. I prefer yeah, you that's to not go. Fair, Ma. I prefer you to go. You like going to school. You don't like missing school with your friends and stuff. Yeah, but Kayla, you need to do some already. You need to do some learning. Stuff. Ma, you got work. Ma, I did some already in school too. So excuse me. Tomorrow I got work. Excuse me. So, I have to go to the pharmacy. Okay, well, I'm going to start my car. I need you to go out there and clean my car. Up. Get the brush out there and put on some gloves and clean my car up with the brush. Okay? Because I need to go get my medicine from the pharmacy. Come on, it's cold outside. I know it is. Let me Wait, see. No, no, this one. You... Let me see what you got. The spicy food? Y'all, this boy didn't order him a... Uh-uh. Let me show you. This boy didn't order him a spicy I know what bowl. To do. Let me see, because I want to see this. Cut the thing open. No, excuse me. Just go over it with the. Be careful with those, please. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Okay. I can't believe they sent the spicy bun. I got the spicy bun. I can't believe they sent it in the mail. It smells. Oh you my god! It's is it is it ice stuff in it? No, where did this come from? Let's see, where did this come from? What state? This came from Lake Monroe, Florida. Let's see. It's called Quay's Spicy Bowls, and it came from Lake Monroe, Florida. Y'all, and they just sent this boy a whole spicy bowl. 
They don't even care. They delivered this. Ain't no no black ice in there or nothing. No, is it called black ice or frozen ice? Something like that. Y'all know the stuff that keeps stuff cold. But it's still cold. But that's because it's cold outside. They probably like, it's cold in Ohio. Shoot. You go eat it? You go taste it? You better. They sent this boy a spicy bowl. Move that box. A spicy bowl with some chips. Take that downstairs. Stop. Stop. Let, here, let me see. Let her have a piece of this. And did you eat her candy this morning? What candy? On the table. Her nerds and her sour candy. No. Here. Take that downstairs. Can she have a piece of that? I said, you think she's going to take the whole thing on my head. Here. I'm about to start my car. Please go get the broom and clean it off for me. I need to go to this pharmacy before they close. They close early I and I need to get air in my tire. Can I come with you? Right next door to the pharmacy. Mom, can I come with you? All right, guys. Mom, I'm going to go throw in some clothes Mom. and I'll be back. Mommy, can I... Why are you crying? Kayvon got this. Oh, my goodness. You making a big old mess. Or is that the water? Sign, go get your brother some napkins. How it taste? He got eggs in there, y'all. I ain't gonna play in his food. He got sausage. Look at that. Ooh, eggs. Egg. Them egg. Buy the egg. I wanna see you buy the egg. Ooh, Let me know if it's red. good. Let me see the inside of it. Ooh, that thing look good, bye. Or you don't like it? You don't like the egg? <laughs> Just the sausage? You don't like that. Kayvon love trying different stuff. His grandma said he need a restaurant. You want a restaurant? When I get rich, you want me to buy you a restaurant? Me too, Mom. Mom, I want a real food. Like, I want a real food. I want real, not fake. And I want a lemonade stand. Okay. So you go sell lemonade, and then your brother go sell the food? No, we both go sell the food and the lemonade. Okay. All right. So he liked the sausage, not the eggs. Do you want to bite the egg? You want to try it? Or no? I might not go like it. <laughs> They said the ruffles and everything. Okay, I got to go to the pharmacy. Let me get my glasses so I can go get my ibuprofen. Uh, all right, you guys. So me and Messiah is in the car. We are about to go to the pharmacy. You got your seatbelt on? Yeah. Okay. Well, let's roll out. Roll out. I'm going to show y'all how this weather is looking. I haven't been outside all day. I hope we don't get no more snow and it stays like this. Um, and yeah. Um, let's go to the farm. Let's see. Show y'all this weather. Yes. Flying, y'all. <laughs> like that's how bad I need some tires. Like it's not even that bad, and I'm sliding in this little bit of snow. See? Ooh. Yeah. Okay, so I'm gonna use two hands, drive, be safe, and I'll see you guys at the pharmacy. Bye. All right, you guys, so I just left the pharmacy and they gave me this big bottle of ibuprofen, 800 milligram. Um, um, so it says to take one tablet by mouth every eight hours as needed for mild or moderate pain. I cannot wait to take one of these ibuprofen. I'm taking two, forget one. What does one um, ibuprofen go do for this lump in my neck? It's uncomfortable, it's painful, it's annoying. I'm hungry too. And I feel like every time I chew, every time I chew, it comes. Like every time I move my mouth, it swells up. Like it's annoying as heck, y'all. That's not real. So I'm trying to debate what we're gonna eat for dinner tonight because I didn't take anything out to cook. And I am just not in the mood to cook. I didn't wash clothes. Y'all, I didn't do anything that I was supposed to do besides rest. I'm not going to the store, so stop asking. I don't know. I told you that, so I don't even know why you came with me. 
You could have stayed home. I don't want to. Okay, stop asking as we go into the store because we're not. It's that simple. You hurting your own feelings. Jesus, y'all. This truck in front of me is... I don't know what they was doing. Just getting on my nerves. But, <clears throat> anywho. All right, guys. So, we made it back home. I'm just sitting in the car. Trying to figure out what we are going to eat for dinner. Look at this, y'all. This is crazy. Man, stop doing this. Look at this. <laughs> I don't know. You don't see it. I don't know. But I am going to take me an ibuprofen. I got some ibuprofen. Thank God for the inflammation. Um, so hopefully that helps with the swelling and that takes the swelling all the way down um, because that's what's annoying me. Like when it's not swollen, it doesn't bother me as much, but every time it swells up, it just makes me feel like crap. Anyway, I need something to drink and I'm also trying to figure out what we're about to eat. And I just feel like I feel bad because I didn't do anything productive today. I didn't wash clothes. I didn't cook dinner. Normally when I'm off, I at least cook them a hot meal. You know, and I'm trying to think. I think I'm just going to go get us some Chipotle or something because. I want Chipotle. I want Chipotle. What else? Like, I don't want no pizza. <laughs> All right, guys. So me and Messiah has decided. Well, daddy too. Um, I just called him and told him what we were going to get for dinner. I'm just going to grab us some ch um, Chipotle. I'm gonna get a chicken bowl. Messiah wants some chicken tacos, and Daddy wants a steak bowl with or with the tortilla wrap. And me inside, we go get some chips with ours because we love the chips. Kayvon acting like he don't want nothing, so I'm not gonna kiss his butt. And be like, what you want? He likes seafood. I'm like, I'm not about to spend no two hundred dollars today on no seafood. Not today, I'm not. When I need to go to the grocery store. Now I do that when my house is full. You know, it's food in the house. Me, everything is good. I'll go spend a hundred and fifty dollars on this, uh, some bags, you know, from the seafood boil place. But baby, when I need groceries and I'm just trying to get us something quick to eat, I'm not about to spend no two hundred dollars, no a hundred and fifty dollars on no freaking seafood when I can go spend that at the grocery store. I'm just trying to get something quick and, 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 and good right now. You know what I'm saying? So and cheap, cheap, cheap is the key. Cheap is cheap. So, um, yeah, we're on our way to Chipotle now. So, I'll see you guys when we get in there. Okay. Huh? Big girl. Oh, they playing music. We are now in line at Taco Bell because I need something cold for my throat. So, I'm like, let me give me an icy. I had got her a fountain drink from um, Chipotle. I got her a Sprite um, inside of this cup. I just put it inside this cup because it was just... <gasps> See? And that's what that thing keep doing. And they didn't have no ice. And if I would have known they didn't have no ice, I would have never got that dang on drink. Because how y'all selling... Um, that's why I never get that fountain drinks. Never. Only reason why I did was because Messiah asked for one. I don't get they fountain. I don't get Chipotle's fountain drinks. I never get fountain drinks, really. So, yeah. I was going to record you guys while we were in, um, Chipotle, but they was playing music. So, I couldn't risk it. Mm. all right you guys so after that disaster of chipotle i would never go to that chipotle again i came upstairs a little irritated i got my ibuprofen next to me i got my drinks let me show y'all i got all my stuff right here that i need baby i got the tv on and i am laying in the bed with my other phone the remote i'm chilling okay this little baby right here next to me <laughs> Uh -huh. Oh, I'm so mad. And y'all charge me, what, 30 something dollars for this goddamn cold ass food. This bowl, y'all, is freezing cold. Like, what the? Hello, um, I was calling. I just left. 
from there. I had got two bowls and three tacos, right? I came straight home. The food in the bowl is ice cold. Like, is the heaters not working or are you guys serving cold food or what was the problem? But the food in the bowl is freezing cold. It's not. But um, I don't know what you want me to do for you, man. I'm just letting you know. You don't have to do nothing. You laughing and all that is very unprofessional. <laughs> I'm letting you know that now. Fucking bitches. So I'm just chilling. I said, let me go put my pajamas on. I'm not doing nothing else for the rest of the day, you guys. This is it. This was totally a lazy day. When I say I didn't do anything but lay in this bed and rest, this abscess or whatever it is, swollen lymphoid, it is just really bringing it brought me down today. Like as far as resting, turn that down, so I'm sorry for a second. It just really brought me down today. Like got me feeling really shitty, really crappy, and I don't like something like that. I wanted to wash clothes today. I wanted to cook. Like, I didn't get to do anything. I'm not even taking a shower right now. I didn't go nowhere all day. I didn't do nothing. I put my pajamas on. I'm going to take one in the morning when I get up. Because I got to go to work tomorrow, 2 to 10. But, baby, I'm just going to chill for the rest of the day. Yeah. And, guys, I just chilling with my beautiful, pretty mom. Aww. You're the best daughter in the world. I love you so much. All right, guys. I'm about to watch this movie on Netflix. It's called Paranoid, I think. Paranoid, it just came out um, last week. It's new. <clears throat> it looked good. It started off crazy. So I'm about to watch this and probably edit this video, get it out for y'all tonight. I love you guys. Thank you for spending the day with me. I didn't do nothing. It was, it, Sorry. It was truly a lazy day. I woke up. I got monetized. Thank you guys Let again for that. Something. Guys, guess what? I went, to, <coughs> I went to Truly's birthday and we was playing with um, Slime and Payton. Okay. So, thank you guys for that. Anyway, um, I greatly and truly and honestly appreciate it. Um, I think I'm going to eat me a popsicle. And, yeah, that's all, you guys. I'll see you guys later. Have a good night. <laughs> All right, you guys, so I just got the shower. I got dressed, got my clothes on. I am ready for the day. Um, it is 11.47. I don't have to be to work till two. Um, I have to go make a small little pit stop. I have to go drop this detergent off to my friend, Ken. She left it in my car when we went to the store the other day. So I have to go drop that off to her and then just relax. I started my laundry. Um, took me a nice hot shower, cleaned that bathroom. So I guess that is the end of this video, you guys. I'm gonna head to work um in a little bit. We'll go to Ken's, then head to work. Um and yeah, I guess I'll talk to you guys tomorrow or later on today or whenever. Um, what's today? Wednesday. Um, tomorrow I work and then I'm off Friday. So, well, we're, we're going to go do some stuff on Friday. We're going to go to the grocery store because I need to go to the grocery store because y'all know they cut your girl food stamps. I only got 200 food stamps this month and it wasn't enough to do nothing with. So, I got to spend cash to go get some meat, go get some food for my house, okay? Fill my house up and all that good stuff. So, yeah, I hope you guys have a beautiful day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.